over here, Spike. Uh, sorry. For this to work, it's crucial we keep our concentration totally on the... <laughs> Spike, this magic needs our full attention to make it happen. There's no other way. I can't help it. Look! <laughs> Never mind her. She's just being Pinkie Pie. Super extra Pinkie Pie today. Hmm. Twitchy twitch a twitch a twitch. Pinkie Pie, what in the wide, wide world of a quest are you up to? Oh, it's my tail! It's my tail! It's a twitch a twitchin'! And you know what that means? Actually, Pinkie, I haven't the slightest idea. The twitchin' means my pinky sense is telling me that stuff's gonna start falling. You two better duck for cover! Oh, Pinky, it's not gonna rain. Why, there's barely even a cloud in the sea. <laughs> he just said, nice catching, frog. <laughs> my little pony, my little pony. Ah, my little pony. I used to wonder what friendship could be. My little pony. Until you all shared its magic with me. Big adventure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? Oh, I'm so, so sorry. You okay, Twilight Sparkle? I just couldn't stand to see the pond getting so overpopulated. What with the frogs all hopping into each other and all. So I decided to fly as many as I can on over to Froggy Bottom Bog. Of course you did. Bye-bye. Um, Twilight? You got a little something on your face there. Oh, really? Did your pinky sense tell you that too? Nah, I could just see it. La 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 la. <laughs> Come on, Spike. Let's continue our practice session where there's a little less commotion. Wow, Sid, that was amazing! Pinkie Pie predicted something would fall, and it did! Oh, come on. She said something would fall, and a frog just happened to fall right around the same time. A coincidence. Nothing else to it. My tail! My tail! Twitch and twitch! Twitch and twitch! Something else is gonna fall! Oh, Pinkie, please. Nothing else is gonna fall. Ah! Oh, no! Twilight fell! Is it safe to go help her? It's okay. My tail stopped twitching. That was amazing! Oh, please. Uh, Twilight, why are you hanging out in a ditch? Because Pinkie Pie predicted it! Honestly, Spike, she did not. Two coincidences in a row like this may be unlikely, but it's still easier to believe than twitchy tails that predict the future. <gasps> twitchy tail? Pinky Saints. <laughs> Don't worry, it's safe. The prediction already came true. Oh, wait. Don't tell me you believe in this stuff, too. I know it doesn't make much sense, but those of us who have been in Ponyville a while have learned over time that if Pinky's a twitching, you better listen. My ears are flopping! My ears are flopping! <laughs> what does that mean? I'll start a bath for you. Huh? <laughs> a bath? This thing keeps on getting more ridiculous by the minute. <sighs> so basically, it works like this. I get different little niggly feelings and they mean different things. Like when my back gets itchy, it means it's my lucky day. And when my knee gets pinchy, that means something scary is about to happen. Is your knee pinchy now? No, but my shoulder's achy. That means there's an alligator in the tub. Ah! How come your knee didn't get pinchy? That isn't just scary, it's downright dangerous. No, it's not, silly. This is my pet alligator, Gummy. He's got no teeth. See? <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. Well, I still don't believe all this special power stuff. It's just a bunch of mumbo jumbo. What's not to believe? You do magic, what's the difference? Huge, for one thing. <clears throat> Magic is something you study and practice. It only happens when you decide to do it. And it's meant to make something specific that you choose to happen, happen. With you, a 
It makes no sense at all. That's so not true, Twilight. Sometimes it's a bunch of random things happening in my body at random times that supposedly predict the future. I call them combos. Combos? Sure. You know, like ear club, the knee twitch, the eye flutter. That means the sky is about to be graced with a beautiful rainbow. Yeah, sure. Uh-oh. I feel a combo coming on. Ear flop, eye flutter, knee twitch. You said that combo meant beautiful rainbow. Oh, no, 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 no. You're thinking of an ear flop, then knee twitch, then eye flutter. This was an ear flop, then eye flutter, then knee twitch. That usually means look out for opening doors. Are you okay? I don't believe this. You don't believe because you don't understand. Hmm. Okay, now when you get another twitch, we'll have all kinds of scientific information. Okie dokie lokie! Any twitches yet? No feet of feet! Now? Anything? What? Hold on! Uh, no. Are you kidding me? After a whole day of non-stop twitching, now that I've got you all hooked up, you're not getting a single one? I don't control it. They just come and go. That makes no sense. Sometimes you just have to believe in things, even when you can't figure them out. I will not believe in anything I cannot explain. What? Hold on. I'm feeling something. Oh my gosh. What? What is it? It's my tummy. That usually means I'm hungry. Let's eat. Uh, you know what? <laughs> Just forget it. I don't need to know if this is real or not. I don't need to understand it. I don't even care. Okie dokie lokie. Uh-oh. <gasps> Pinky, have you seen Twilight? Uh-huh. Twilight? What are you doing back there? Uh, did you two plan this? Plan what? Ugh, this is ridiculous. This can't be happening. This makes no sense. I have to figure this out. Spike, don't you know better than to sneak up on ponies? Oh, sorry, but, um, well, isn't that what you're doing? <gasps> no! <sighs> I'm doing scientific research. I'm observing Pinkie Pie. Scientific name, Pinkius Piacus, in its natural habitat. Pinkius Huacus? <gasps> There's something fishy going on with the whole twitchy prediction thing, and I'm getting to the bottom of it. So, shh! Come on, Pinkius Piacus is on the move. Hmm, itchy nose. <gasps> Aha, that makes no sense. See, she's hiding like something's about to fall from the sky. But a twitchy tail means something's gonna fall from the sky, not an itchy nose. This proves, perhaps conclusively, that... Ah! Spike, where are you going? I'm trying to teach you the value of science. Ah! 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 What's she doing now? Smelling a flower. Holy guacamole! I wonder what that means. Probably that the flower smells good. Wait, I'm getting something. Ear flop. Eye flutter, knee twitch. 
Hold on. You told me that's the combo that says watch out for opening doors. <laughs> you really, really believe this stuff, don't you? Here, let me show you there's nothing to be afraid of. You see? I promise you there's nothing to fear from that... Ah! <laughs> You came to visit my new apple cellar. How nice. Twy, you okay? Uh, Twy? Here, let me help you. Okay. Take this down. Twitchy tail. Twitchy tail? <gasps> Twitchy tail! Hey, hey, Spike, we can't let Pinky know we're here, remember? Something's gonna fall! Something's gonna fall! Run for your life! <laughs> Oh, Spike, honestly, you're overreacting. Hey, Applejack, what you doing? Taking more apples to my new apple cellar. How about you, Pinky? What you doing? Oh, letting Twilight secretly follow me all day without me knowing. You mean you knew all along? Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> Silly, that would have spoiled the secret. <laughs> Tail, still twitching? All done. Clear skies from here on in, as far as I can tell. <laughs> oh no, what does that one mean? Don't know, never gotten any like it before. But whatever that shudder's about, it said juice. Something you never expect to happen is gonna happen. <laughs> and it's gonna happen? <gasps> That's where Fluttershy's headed. Oh no, is it about her? Uh, I'm not sure. We better go and make sure she's okay. Calm down, every pony. All we know right now is that Pinkie Pie just got a case of the shivers. That's all. <gasps> hey, I thought you didn't believe in this stuff. I don't. I just want to be there to see the look on Pinkie's face when we find out nothing's wrong. Okie dokie. A jacket or something? No, thanks. I'm fine. <laughs> so, what do you think happened to Fluttershy? I hope nothing. I know, but what do you think happened? I'm trying not to think about it. Me too. But I'm thinking about it anyway. Like, what if she exploded? Just exploded? For no reason? Yeah, like, boom! Whoa! I know. What if... What if she exploded and then, and then exploded again? Can you do that? Can you explode twice? Of course not. But what if she exploded and exploded again and then... Will oh, you two stop? She's fine, I'm sure of it. I hope you're right, for Fluttershy's sake. Look, there's Froggy Bottom Bog! You're okay! Of course. <sighs> what a relief. I'm so glad everything's all right. Sorry. I know it's not nice to gloat, but... Aha! I told you there was nothing to worry about, and I was right. Pinkie Pie said whatever she was shuddering about was a <laughs> doozy, and... <laughs> and the only <laughs> doozy here is how right I am. Um, do I lie? Pinkie's made a lot of predictions today, but... <laughs> Ugh, what is that smell? But what we've shown here is that there's no point in believing <laughs> in anything you can't see for yourself. Well, then see what's b b behind you, Twilight. I see it, but I don't believe it. Is that a Hydra? Who cares?
all for turning a hydra into a mouse? No. How about a squirrel? No. How about no small rodents of any kind? That's too bad. A hop, skip, and a jump! <laughs> He's too close. I'll distract him. You two go, now! <laughs> oh, what would a brave pony like Rainbow Dash do? or what? But you said there'd be a doozy here at Froggy Bottom Bog. And I'd say we just had ourselves one heck of a doozy. I mean, that Hydra... <laughs> Tinky? That wasn't it. Huh? What wasn't what? What are you talking about, Pink? The Hydra wasn't the doozy. <laughs> I'm still getting the shutters. <laughs> you see? There it is again. Whatever the doozy was at Froggy Bottom Bog, my pinky sense says it still hasn't happened. Huh? But I... What? The Hydra wasn't the doozy. How could it not be the doozy? What could be doozier than that? Dunno, but it just wasn't it. <laughs> oh, I give up. Give what up, Twy? The fight. I can't fight it anymore. I don't understand how, why, or what. But Pinky Scent somehow makes sense. I don't see how it does, but it just does. Just because I don't understand doesn't mean it's not true. You mean you believe? Yep. I guess I do. Celestia. I'm happy to report that... Spike, what have I been saying about focus? I know, but I... Well... What's wrong, Spike? Never thought you'd see me with an umbrella hat on? Not really, no. Pinky's tail's a twitching. What else can I do? <laughs> <laughs> I am happy to report that I now realize there are wonderful things in this world you just can't explain. But that doesn't necessarily make them any less true. It just means you have to choose to believe in them. And sometimes, it takes a friend to show you the way. Honk! Honk. Always your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. There it goes again! I wonder what's gonna drop out of the sky this time. You never know. <gasps> Twitchy tail? Holy guacamole!
Oh, hi, Pinkie Pie. This is your singing telegram. I hope it finds you well. You're invited to a party because we think you're really swell. Got me turning one year old to help us celebrate. The cake will be delicious, the festivities first rate. There will be games and dancing, pop for apples, cut a rug. And when the party's over, we'll gather around for a group hug. No need to bring a gift, being there. Lots of stuff. It won't be the same without you, so we hope that you say yes. So please, oh please, RSVP and come and be our guest. Next time, I think I'll just pass out written invitations. My little pony, my little pony. Ah. Ship could be my little pony. Until you all shared its magic with me. Big adventure, tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness, it's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have my Do you know you are my very best friends? for your spring has sprung party? Nope, something new. It's Gummy's favorite. Ooh, this is my jam. Having fun? A blast. You always throw the best parties, Pinkie Pie. Another delightful soiree. It's been lovely. You sure you don't want to stay? There's still some cake left. Uh, I think I'm gonna pass. Great party, though. We should do this again soon. <gasps> we should do this again soon! It's soon! Pardon me? You said we should have another party soon, and it's soon! Here's your invitation! You're invited to Gummy's after birthday party this afternoon at 3 o'clock. All our bestest friends are invited, and there's gonna be dancing and games and cake and ice cream and punch! This afternoon? As in, this afternoon this afternoon? Yes, indeedy! Oh, gosh. I wish I could make it, but I've gotten a bit behind in my studies. I've really got to hit the books. I understand. Your studies come first. But don't worry. We'll be sure to save you some cake. Please do. Oh, and Twilight, you shouldn't hit the books. You should really just read them. I'll keep that in mind. Huh? Oh, hi, Pinkie Pie. What brings you around these parts? Who's ready to shake their who thing? It's an invitation to Gummy's after birthday party this afternoon. There's 
can be dancing and games and cake and ice cream and punch? This afternoon? As in this afternoon, this afternoon? That's funny. That's just what Twilight said. And the answer is yes. It's this afternoon. Oh. Uh, well, I... I, uh, I don't think I can make it, because, uh, I have to, uh, uh, you know what? I, uh, pick apples. Yep, apples, because that's what we do with the apples. We, uh, pick them. <laughs> Okie dokie dokie. A party is still a party, even if there are only three guests. Anything else I can do for you, most beautiful one? <laughs> mm, perhaps you could take a bath. How do I put this delicately? You smell like a rotten apple core that's been wrapped in moldy hay and dipped in dragon perspiration. <sighs> Love the new hat. Very modern. What's the occasion? Gummy's after birthday party is this afternoon. I'm delivering the invitations. The party is this afternoon? As in, this afternoon, this afternoon. It's so strange. Every pony keeps saying that. Oh, do they? I know it's short notice, but we had such a great time at his birthday party, I thought we could have even more fun at his after birthday party. And I'm sure that we would, but I'm going to have to decline. I have to wash my hair. Don't be silly. Your hair doesn't look dirty. It doesn't? Nope. See? <laughs> dirty. I have to go. Huh. No Twilight, no Applejack, no Rarity. Oh well, a party is still a party even with only two guests. This afternoon? As in... Yes! As in this afternoon, this afternoon. Oh man, we'd love to, but... We're house-sitting this afternoon. <gasps> Both of you? It's a, a big house. Uh, look at the time. We'd really better get going. What? <gasps> Maybe I could bring you some after birthday cake and ice cream. Who are you house-sitting for? Harry. Harry? Yeah, I don't think you know him. That's strange. I know just about every pony around here. He's a bear. A bear? Yep, he's a bear, all right. And he'll be pretty upset if we don't get over to his house soon. <laughs> what? There's a bear around here who lives in a house? It's uh, really more of a cave. But he's fixed the place up so much it feels like a house. And uh, he wants us to look after his house, a uh, cave, while he's... Uh... At the beach. He's vacationing at the beach? Yep, he loves to... Collect Play seashells. beach volleyball. Play beach Collect volleyball. seashells. Collect Play out. seashells. Gotta go. Something strange is definitely going on around here, Gummy. Sure, Rainbow Dash and Fluttershy had to house it for that vacationing bear, but what are the chances all my other friends would have plans this afternoon too? Rarity has to wash her hair. Applejack has to pick apples. Twilight is behind on her studies and has to hit the books. The more I think about it, the more those are starting to sound like <gasps> excuses. That doesn't look like studying or hitting. Oh, you must be here for Shh. Is Pinkie Pie around? Oh, I don't think so. Good. I don't want her to know anything about this. Yes, of course. I'll be right back. But we're friends. What wouldn't Twilight want me to know anything about? <gasps> She's coming back. There you go. Thanks. And remember, not a word to Pinkie Pie. Hey, what's with the tin can? Our cover's been blown. Oh, 
need a new disguise. She didn't see you at the sweet shop, did she? I don't think so. Oh, good. I'd hate for her to ruin everything. Me too. She was planning on throwing an after-birthday party today? I'm just glad I was able to come up with an excuse for why I couldn't be there. Me too. This is obviously going to be so much better. As long as we keep her from finding out about it, it will. See you later. <laughs> Every pony loved my parties. Hi, Pinkie Pie. <laughs> uh oh. Rainbow Dad, wait! <sighs> Where are you going? No, uh, I mean, yes, I mean, you can't come in here. Rainbow Dash just went in there. Oh, well, she was just bringing in some supplies. Yep, supplies for the renovation. Fixing up the whole thing, top to bottom. Uh, lots of construction going on in there right now. You heard her? Construction. <laughs> Yep, construction. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> Okie dokie, Loki. Huh. <sighs> <sighs> they don't want me to know about. Well, I'm gonna know about it. I'm gonna know about it big time. And I know just who's gonna tell me all about it. Tell me all about it big time! Wow, nice spread. It's all yours, Spike. All you have to do is talk. That's it? Oh, you got it. Okay, uh, beautiful weather we're having, eh? I love a sunny spring day, don't you? The birds chirping, and flowers blooming. No, no, no. Talk about our friends. Oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, there's Twilight Sparkle. She's a unicorn. Good with magic, real brainiac. And then you got Rarity. Total knockout. Twilight seems to think I don't have a chance with her, but eh, what does she know? Let's see, there's, there's Fluttershy, a Pegasus afraid of heights. <laughs> What's up with that? Ah, no, you're not understanding me. I want you to confess! Confess? Confess! I'm the one who spilled juice all over Twilight's copy of Magical Mysteries and Practical Potions! And? And I'm the one who used up all the hot water in Ponyville yesterday when I took a seven-hour bubble bath! And? And sometimes, 
when no one's around, I do this. Looking good, Spike. Looking real good. No, 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 no! What do you want to hear? Tell me what you want me to say and I'll say it. Tell me that my friends are all lying to me and avoiding me because they don't like my parties and they don't want to be my friends anymore! <sighs> your friends are all lying to you and avoiding you because they don't like your parties and they don't want to be your friends anymore. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! Oh no, my friends don't like my parties and they don't want to be my friends anymore. Uh, so... Thank you all so much for coming. It means so much to Gummy. Could I have some more punch? Well, of course you can have some more punch, Mr. Turnip. This is one great party. You really outdone yourself. Why, thank you, Rocky. I'm having a delightful time as well. I'm so glad, Sir Lancelot. My dad's got my outfit in this little slice of cake. Anything for you, Madame LaFlower. I'm just glad none of them ponies showed up. Oh, they're not so bad. Not so bad? Police! They're a bunch of losers. Oh, come on now. Losers might be a little strong, don't you think? After the way they treated you, I say losers isn't strong enough. Well, it was pretty rude. Pretty rude? It was downright despicable! It was, wasn't it? If I were you, I wouldn't speak to them ever again. You know what? I'm not gonna speak to them ever again. And I'm not gonna invite them to another party as long as I live! They don't deserve to be invited to my parties. Not after the way they've been acting. These speak of our losers. Yes, that's right. Well done. Yeah, you show them. Who could that be? Hey there, Pinkie Pie. Sorry I was in such a rush earlier. Had some place to be and couldn't slow down and say hello. You know how it goes. I don't know how it goes, all right. Yeah. So, why don't you come with me over to Sweet Apple Acres? No, thanks. I'm spending time with my real friends. Isn't that right, Madame LaFlower? Oui, that is correct, Madame. Uh, Pinkie Pie? Another slice of cake, Sir Lancelot? I'd love one. All righty. What do you say we get on out of Creek Bee Town and head over to Applejack's? She's not going anywhere. I most certainly am not. I'm having a wonderful time right here. You should really just come with me. You heard the lady. She ain't going nowhere, chump. Who are you calling a chump, chump? Oh, that's it. Party's <sighs> over. Come on, Pinkie Pie. No. Pinkie Pie, let's go. I said no. <laughs> you <laughs> have to come with me. No, I don't. <laughs> Oh, you want to do this the hard way? We'll do this the hard way! We're here! Surprise! I really thought she'd be more excited. Excited? Excited? Why would I be excited to attend my own farewell party? Farewell party? Yes! You don't like me anymore, so you decided to kick me out of the group and throw a great big party to celebrate! A farewell to Pinkie Pie party! Why in the world would you think we didn't like you anymore, Sugar Cube? Why? 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 Uh, yeah, because we wanted your party to be a surprise. We've been planning this party for such a long time, we had to make excuses for why we couldn't attend Gummy's party so that we could get everything ready for yours. If this is a farewell party, why does the cake I picked up from Sugar Cube Corner say, Happy Birthday Pinkie Pie? It's my birthday! Oh, how could I have forgotten my own birthday? <sighs> and you like me so much you decide to throw me a surprise party? That's what we've been trying to tell you, darling.
darling. You girls are the best friends ever! How could I have ever doubted you? It's okay, Pinkie Pie. It could have happened to any of us. Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't worry yeah. about it. I'm just glad I haven't been replaced by a bucket of turnips. Huh? You don't want to know. All right, girls, enough of this gabbing. Let's party! <laughs> <laughs> Dear Princess Celestia, I am writing to you from the most delightful party. I am not only having a great time with my friends, but also was given the opportunity to learn a valuable lesson about friendship. Always expect the best from your friends and never assume the worst. Rest assured that a good friend always has your best interests at heart. Your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. You girls wouldn't mind if we celebrated Gum's after birthday party too, would you? His party was cut short and he's pretty upset about it. Oh, oh definitely. Was a smart. Yeah, yeah, why not? <laughs> Let's have a party for Gummy. <laughs> Can you believe the new baby is finally here? Cupcake and Carrot Cake must be so proud. I wonder if it's a filly or a colt. I want to see the new baby pony. I want to see. Which one is it? Meet our son, Pound Cake. Hey, Aww. And our daughter, Pumpkin Cake. trying to sleep. But I was just... Shh! But... Shh! Happy, happy birthday to you and you today! Now, how in thunderation is one of them twins a Pegasus and the other one a unicorn? Easy. My great-great-great-great-grandfather was a unicorn, and Cupcake's great-aunt second cousin twice removed was a Pegasus. Uh, that makes sense, right? Aw, oh, yeah. <laughs> Just you wait. Once little Pound Cake there gets his wings going, he'll be all over the place. And be careful around Pumpkin Cake. Baby unicorns get strange magic surges that come and go. Quick, make a wish and blow out your candles, which is easy, because there are zero candles. You are zero years old after all. Shh. My little pony, my little pony. Could be Until you all shared its magic with me Big adventure Tons of fun A beautiful heart Faithful and strong Sharing kindness It's an easy feat And magic makes it all complete You have mine Do you know you are my very best friends? Got it. <laughs> Is any pony hungry? Uh, no thanks. I just had a big breakfast. I'm on it. Take 
No, you see, Pinky, the babies need to be burnt. All set now? Everything good? Okay, who wants to play again? Uh-uh-uh, pound cake. No pounding things. Uh-uh-uh, we don't chew on things, pumpkin cake. Except food. <gasps> Great cinnamon sticks! I completely forgot! No, you just fed them bottles, remember? Not the baby's food. The food for the enormously big catering order we have to deliver today. Oh, with the new twins. We've been so distracted. Quick, honey bun. We need to find a babysitter to watch the foals while we take care of this. I can do it! I want to do it! Oh, the babies love playing with me. I'll do it! Wonder who would be available on such short notice? Me! Me! Pick me! Oh, I would love to babysit. But I can't today, sorry. I promised Angel we'd go on a picnic. You understand, don't you? You're not mad at me, are you? Please don't be mad at me! I'll do it! Pick me! I have to finish this report for the princess, summarizing all my other reports to the princess. I want to babysit! Pick me! Babysit? Now? When there's a swarm of hungry caterpillars heading this way? I gotta get all these apples picked before they get swarmed on. <laughs> to the Wonderbolts air show this afternoon. Got a dash. Ask me. Me, 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 me. Moi, babysit. Oh, no, 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 no. I am flattered that you would think about me, though. Pinkie Pie, how would you like to babysit for us? <gasps> I don't know. I'll have to check my schedule. <laughs> now, Pinky, are you sure you really understand the responsibility of watching over two babies? I can be responsible. Why, responsibility is my middle name. Pinky Responsibility Pie. <laughs> but this time, you need to take care of them, not just play with them. You have to be responsible. Yes, I know. I will. I am. Oh, here you are, dearie. All of your responsibilities are on this list. Whoa, that's a lot of responsi... Consider it done. We'll frost it when we get there. Come on, sugar plum, tick, tick. Take good care of our two precious little ginger snacks. No problemo, Mr. and Mrs. Cake. Everything is under control. Uh-oh.
about it. Fine! I wasn't gonna pull out the showstopper, but you're a lovely audience and I think you deserve it! First you jiggle your tail, oink, 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 then you wriggle your snout, oink, 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 then you wriggle your rump, oink, 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 then shout it out, oink, 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 first you jiggle your tail, oink, 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 then you wriggle your snout, oink, 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 then you wriggle your rump, oink, 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 then shout it out, oink, 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 first you jiggle your tail, Babysitting business. <sighs> Snack time. That's easy enough. Okie dokie. Eat up. Like this. Nom nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Ah. No pumpkin cake, we eat food, not tablecloths. had to do so I thought I'd stop by and see if you needed any help. Whoa! Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming. I can't begin to tell you what my day has been like. I mean, these babies just won't listen to reason and don't even get me started on their taste in stand-up comedy. It's okay, Pinky. I figured you would need some help. That's why I stopped by. Excuse me? 
Babies take a lot of work, and some ponies are just not cut out to handle the responsibility. Is that so? Well, thanks for stopping by, Twilight. Sorry, I don't have time to visit. I'm very, very busy with my responsibilities here. I I'm happy to help, but it's no trouble now. Yeah. Well, a bold of She thinks I can't handle things on my own. Maybe because I haven't handled things on my own. Well, I can handle things on my own. Used for napping, sleeping, and on occasion with permission as a pretend old timey western fort. It is not a trampling, so stop your jumping right now, mister. <laughs> and you, young Billy, we do not put anything on our mouth that we cannot safely and properly digest, so stop slobbering on that toy this instant. <laughs> now, we have all had a very exhausting afternoon, and it's time for all good little bulls to take their nap. So, Sleep tight. Now that's what I call handling things. Look! <laughs> 
There! Now who's the responsible one? Celestia. I've always had fun playing with little kids, and I thought babysitting meant just more playtime, right? Wrong! Being a caregiver is way more responsibility than just being a playmate. And today I learned that sometimes our desire for responsibility can outrun our actual ability to handle it. Pinkie Pie, we're back! How did everything go? <gasps> Are we in the right place? Shh. Hi. Pinky, this is just, just amazing is what it is. We have no idea how responsible you really are. Would you be interested in becoming our go-to babysitter on a permanent basis? Uh, hmm. uh, let me check my schedule. Should be available a week from never. Pinky ah. pie. I have some free time next Tuesday. Miss Pinky, you flatterer, you. Well, happy birthday, G. 
Cheerly. Thank you, Pinky. Happy day after your birthday, Sakura. What a lovely hi, Miss Pinkie Pie. And Miss Matilda, happy birthday to you. In 132 days. Pinkie Pie, how do you remember everything about every pony? Because every pony's my friend, and I love to see my friends smile. A whip, kid. Now, how about that C? Hmm. Calvin, Calhoun, Caleb, Carl, Carmine, Carlo, Charlie, Chester, Chico, Claudio, Cletus, Clipper, Conroy, Cornelius, Cortez, Craig, Christopher, Cooper. Cranky! It's Cranky, all right! And your middle name? Uh, no. I'm sorry? No. Ooh, one more time. Uh, doodle. <gasps> so you're a cranky doodle donkey? You're a cranky doodle donkey guy, a cranky doodle donkey. I've never met you, but you're my new friend, and I'm your best friend, Pinkie Pie. Come on now, doodle, give us a smile. Nope, he calls me Doodle. What just happened? Me? 
Meet some pony new. Check. Introduce myself. Check. Sing random song out of nowhere. Check. Become instant best friends. Uncheck. I don't get it. How can some pony not become instant best friends with me? Was it something I said? Was it something I sang? This is no time for the blame game, Pinky. There's some pony new in town, and you need to win him over. Try everything you can to make Cranky smile and be your friend. Check! All right, Pinky. If you're gonna win Cranky's friendship, you're gonna have to bring your A game. Let's do this. Howdy doody, Cranky Doodle. So, uh, are you moving to Ponyville, Cranky? What gave you the hint there, kid? A cart full of stuff, maybe? Well, I'd be happy to show you around. It's the least a new friend can do. Listen, kid. I traveled around Equestria my entire life. I've made many friends. I don't need any more. Gosh, I could never have too many friends. Well, why don't you go and make some more? But I don't need to go when I can stay and make friends with you. Look, kid. You... Oh, Cranky, you can call me Pinky. All of my friends do. Look, kid. I came to Ponyville for some peace and quiet and privacy, to be alone with my memories. All I want is to get to my new home and unpack my stuff. Ooh, what does this bobble do? Don't touch that! Ah, what's this? Please, don't! Keep your hooves off my wagon. Okay, Cranky. <gasps> I promise not to take your wagon because I got one of my own. I use it to welcome folks. Who'd have guessed? Maybe we can be wagon buddies. Well, you gotta at least let me give you the special welcome that comes with it. Let's get this over with. That's the spirit! Spa treatment was gift enough. It's not going to explode or anything, promise. Just open it. It's a new toupee. I had my friend 
and Rarity make it. She calls it the Dream Boat Special. This is wonderful. Thanks, kid. He's starting to warm up, but still no smile. Hmm. What you doing there, old buddy, old pal? What's it look like? Looks like a yard sale. I'll give you two bits for this. <laughs> I'm not selling, kid. I'm unpacking. Well, why didn't you say so? I thought I had. This is so pretty. Where'd you get it? Manhattan. Now put it down. Gently. Really? What were you doing there? Trying to find a friend. Ooh, I'm always trying to find friends. And today I'm down to you. See how good I am at it? This was a special friend. Like me? No, you're extra special, kid. Yes, I'm in. Wow, where in Equestria did you get this, Cranky? Philadelphia. It's awfully pretty. Yes, yeah, she was. Huh? I mean, it was. I mean, it is. Yes, it's pretty. Now put it down. I wonder where Cranky got this. Huh. Will you look at that? Hey, Cranky, can I ask you about... What did you say? Yay, yeah, yay, yeah, yay! Yeah. What have you done? Not all better, all soggy! I'm sorry, Cranky. Oh, you're sorry. Well, then everything is fine. It is? No, it isn't. Listen to me, kid. I will never be your friend. Never or never ever? Never, ever, 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 ever! That's four evers. That's like forever. I just can't believe it. Cranky said he would never, forever be my friend. It was horrible. I know this is hard for you, Pinky, seeing that you're friends with every pony, but you just have to accept that Cranky is going to be an exception. He just doesn't want to be bothered. Yeah, he doesn't want to be bothered by your over the top, super hyper antics. Rainbow! No, no. It's okay, Twilight. I get what you're saying, what you're both saying, and I guess. I can leave Cranky alone. Right after he accepts my apology. Cranky! No! No! Leave me alone! Wait! I understand that you don't want me as a friend! No! I don't! So I just wanted to say I'm sorry! Fine! You said it! But you accept my apology? No! Oh, Cranky, please accept my apology! Please! No! But I'm really, really, really... <laughs> really, really... Ah! Really, really, really... Really, really, really... There's nothing you can do. You ruined my book. You destroyed all I have to remember her by. Her? Her who? The special friend? Go away, Pinky! Cranky, it's me again. I understand that you don't want to be my friend or accept my apology. Before I leave you alone forever, I have something to at least try to make up for ruining your book. 
No, I don't want it, kid. Anything you would give me is sure to lead to some sort of disaster. Goodness, you really are cranky. It can, and it is. Matilda, but how? Pinky. But I never told you about her. You didn't have to. I put two and two and two together, and it added up to Matilda. What? Well, when you were talking about your souvenirs, you said something about trying to find a special friend. And you know, I wasn't just born yesterday. Nuh-uh, my birthday's in for another 75 days. Huh? And then, in your scrapbook, there was a flower, an old ticket, and a menu from the Grand Galloping Gala. And I knew I recognized all these things. But how could you have ever seen them before? Because I also have them in my scrapbook. And I'd seen them in Matilda's book! Oh, Matilda. The night we met at the gala was the most magical night of my life. I couldn't wait to see you again. But when I came to your room the next day, you were gone. Didn't you get my note? No, I never got it. Never since that day, I've gone from town to town to town, searching all over Equestria for you. Until finally, I gave up. I came to Ponyville to retire from my search. I was living in Ponyville the whole time. I always hoped that someday you would come and find me. Doodle. Uh, Matilda? No pony calls him Doodle. No pony, but Matilda. Mm. <laughs> oh. Oh, Doodle. I am so happy to see you. <laughs> Yes, Pinky, I accept your apology, and I am honored to call you my friend. Pinky, we're eternally grateful to you, but uh, Matilda and I just want to spend some time together in peace and quiet. Oh, um, but we're still friends? Pinky, you went way, way, way out of your way to make me happy. Of course we're friends. Great! Dear Princess Celestia, there are many different kinds of friends and many ways to express friendship. Some friends like to run and laugh and play together. But others just like to be left alone, and that's fine, too. But the best thing about friendship is being able to make your friends smile. He had a cranky doodle sweetheart. She's his cranky doodle joy. I love the cranky doodle boy. Yes, I love the cranky doodle boy. Pinky! Whoops, privacy. Sorry. Again, Twy, you can do it. Phew, this spell's a toughie, but I feel lucky this time. One, two, <laughs> Pinky, why'd you do that? Because hugs are fun and horrific, especially when you throw one around a friend. What you doing? Trying to turn that apple into an orange. Which you kind of threw her aim off. What a cute orange birdie! Do me that, Twilight! Do me, do me! Ooh, Rarity! Want to see Twilight turn me into an orange? It's gonna be fun, a fun, fun! As fun as creating this haute couture ensemble that I just finished making. Delightful, no? <gasps> this is terrible! I admit it's perhaps not.
not my finest work, but I... You had total awesome, amazing fun and I missed out on it? <sighs> Wait, what if there's more awesome, amazing fun with friends happening somewhere in the right now that I'm missing out on too? We weren't gonna turn into an orange, I swear. Hey, Rainbow Dash, what you doing? This punk cloud got so heavy it's making fog. Figure I'll thin this bad boy out so it floats back up. Ooh, fun! <laughs> Gotta go! Uh, thanks, Pinky. Hey, Applejack! That looks like fun! Can I join you? Whee! Next time I'll pull you! Fluttershy! <laughs> there! <gasps> you are doing anything <gasps> fun? Not especially. Oh, good. Fun is hard. <gasps> my little pony, my little pony. Adventure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you're all my very best friends? Feeling better, Pinky? absolutely lootly Thanks for letting me rest in your butterfly grow while I get my pinky strength back. What are friends for? That's just the thing! I've got so many wonderful friends having fun in every last corner of Ponyville, I can't figure out how to keep up with it all. It's driving me even more coco local than usual! I can promise to not do anything fun at all if that would help. You are such a good friend. There you are, Pinky. Been looking everywhere for you, girl. Hey, Pinky. Got something fun planned this afternoon thought you might want to know about. Well, I'll be an apple crisp. I'm here for the same reason. This is perfect. Everyone will now bring their fun to me. Oh, this will solve everything. Why didn't I think of that? Actually, what I meant is after I'm done whipping up today's weather, I'll be chilling by the lake catching some rays. Want to hang? I am so fair. And my family's having a barn raising this afternoon at Sweet Apple Acres. And I'm also so fair. Wee-wee! But that's when I'll be at the swimming hole. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Whichever one you choose is okay with me. Me too. <gasps> choose? One, two... Pinky! What in the wide, wide world of Equestria are you doing now? Timing myself galloping back and forth between the swimming hole and Sweet Apple Acres. I'm trying to cut down my time so Rainbow Dash dives off the swing. I can get to Sweet Apple Acres to help with the barn raising and then be back in time to see Rainbow Dash hit the water after doing a double flip. <sighs> if I can cut my time by only 20 minutes, I'm good. <laughs> oh, Pinky, I'm afraid no matter how hard you try, the only way to pull something like that off is if there's more of you to go around. That's it, Twilight! The legend of the miracle! Legend of the who what now? Pinky! I'm familiar with loads of legends, and I never heard of... Does this mean practice is over? Of course not. Back to work. Seems like hardly any pony's been here in ages. I hope I'm remembering the rhymes right from my Nana Pinky's story. Where the brambles are thickest, there you will find... Uh, a pond beyond the most twisted of vines. What is that? Oh, I heard a voice. Oh, <laughs> it was me. Ouch. Stop scratching your feet, brambles. And... <gasps> the miracle! Oh, and there's that voice again. Ah, Pinky, you have got to stop talking to yourself. Starting now. And into her own reflection she stared, uh, yearning for one whose reflection she shared, and solemnly sweared not to be scared at the prospect of being doubly fair. Wow, the legend is true, it really works! <laughs> 
Oh, hey, wait. I promise not to talk to myself anymore. I should say something to her. Or would that still be talking to myself? Excuse me. Hi. Hi. Can I have a word with you? Uh, I mean, me? Listen, I can see you're having lots of fun, but... Fun? Did somebody say fun? Where? I did. Over here. I thought someone said something about fun. Where is it? Over here? Over here? I don't see it. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, calm yourself. There's loads of fun to be had in Ponyville with my girls. Trot on over back to Ponyville with me, and I'll tell you all about them. And then there's Rarity. She's the one with all the fancy clothes and ribbons and stuff. I'm thinking she can make us all matching t-shirts that say Team Pinky. And is this Ponyville? Where's the fun? Where's the fun? Uh, well, let's see. Applejack's having a barn raising at... <laughs> it's that away! Wait, come back! Don't forget to meet me back here to tell me everything about everything, like I was there myself. Because I'm you, and, and you're me, and oh my gosh! This is the greatest plan ever! Now off to double my fun! I don't know. Cloud busting was tougher work than usual today. I'm kind of exhausted. That's fine. You relax. At least we'll still be together. Glad you made it, Pinky. I thought you maybe went to Applejack's instead. I did. Oh, the barn up yet? I have no idea. But I thought you said you were just at Applejack's. Actually, I'm probably still on my way there now. <laughs> Oh, Pinkie Pie, I'm so glad you wandered by. I know I promised not to have any fun today, but, oh, I couldn't help myself. All of my critter friends wanted a picnic, but I couldn't disappoint them. Come join us. We have plenty of hay juice and marmalade to go around. Don't we, critters? <laughs> Wait! Well, that sounds super fun! Oh, but Apple John sounds super fun, too! Uh, and, and I can't do one without missing out on the other! Who's Apple John? Two fun things at once, but which? Which? Oh, can't decide! <laughs> Trouble breathing! <laughs> Walls closing up! Walls? But we're outside. <laughs> Goodness, was it something I said? Yes! Huh? So you see, that's how I'm able to have fun in two places at once. Duplicates of you, huh? <laughs> yeah, sure, Pinky. Look, I was just gearing up to catch some Z's, so, uh... Gotcha! I'll have the rest of my fun really quietly. How'd you do that? Just trying to show a little consideration for my sleepy friend. Ooh, ooh, gotta run! Looks like I'm trying to get my attention. Excuse me. And me. Ooh, ooh, tell me all about it. Did they pull the walls of the barn up slow or fast? I, maybe slow to medium fast, somewhere in that range? I, ooh, did you get ice cream? What kinds did they have? Banana prickle? I didn't make it! I was on my way there and then Fluttershy. Fluttershy. Yeah, her. She offered something else fun for me to do. A picnic with cute little animals. Ah, uh, how could you say no to that? That's what I'm saying. Then I would have missed this super fun thing with applesauce. Applejack. <laughs> no, I didn't do anything fun at all. Oh, my poor, poor me. There, there. Tell me what, we just need a couple more Pinkie Pies. Easy peasy. Really? Come on, would I lie to me? And, and solemnly, solemnly swear not to be scared of the prospect of being doubly fair. Look, a double me! I think you mean a double double me? Plus another double double me, which makes two double double me's, or a double 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 me, if you will. <laughs> Did somebody say fun? Where? Fun, 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 fun! Fun, 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 Now, Applejack, Rainbow Dash, and Fluttershy are covered, plus one extra pinky pie in case we get an extra invite from some pony else. Perfect! Okay, let's go! And so I swear, swear not to be scared of the prospect of me doubly fair! Okay, good enough. Pinkie Pies, moving on! Not to be scared of the prospect of me doubly fair! What in the name of Pink? Knock it off! Bye, 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 bye. There. 
Adventure Bus, we should have every nook and cranny of Fun and Ponyville covered at all times. An unprecedented and massive undertaking. But first, a pop quiz on the names I taught you. Applejack. Fluttershy. Pinkie Pie. Excellent. Okay, let's get on with this, folks. Fan out on three. One. <laughs> Good enough. La, 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 la. <laughs> what the? Wow! I I wasn't kidding about the duplicates. Except now there's triple cakes and quadruple cakes. <laughs> Dash is gonna love this. Oh, if I push her around on this floaty thing, it'll be fun and relaxing. Uh oh. No more pinkies. I can't take it. Barnet Applejacks right now. Maybe I better go check. came from so I can find out who's responsible for y'all ruining our bar race. Uh, you look pretty busy right now, so uh, uh, maybe we should talk a little later? Fun! 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 Y'all come back here and clean up after yourselves this instant! Oh no, what have I done? What have I done? My poor friends! Okay, oh, every pony. Please, 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 calm please. down. Calm down? I just had a pinky hurricane raging through my shop. And they trashed our critter picnic. Oh, what, what, what is that all? Oh, please, every pony. Hang on while I try to figure something out. Come on, Spike. I've got to try to remember the name of that legend she mentioned. The Legend of the Mirror Pond. It describes a spell I can use to send them back where they came from. That's perfect. Let's go. But there's a catch. If I can't figure out which one's the real Pinky, I might send her back by mistake. Well, we'll just have to figure out who the real one is then. Shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> Does any pony here know how we can tell the real Pinkie Pie from all the rest of them? Uh, I don't know. Twilight, I have to talk to you. I need your help. Excuse me, whoever you are. But I'm not talking to any of you pinkies unless you're the real pinky. Oh, but, but I am the real pinky. No, you're not. I'm the real pinky. I'm the real pinky. No, I'm the real pinky. I'm the real pinky. No, I'm the real pinky. I'm the real pinky. I'm the real pinky. How in coronation are we supposed to tell which is the real pinky? I have no idea. Me either. Oh, we've all got the same adorable tails. We've all got the same adorable manes. We've all got the same adorable hooves. Which one of us is the real Pinky? Uh, I haven't the slightest clue. And if I can't tell us apart, who can? <laughs> <laughs> This is hopeless. Maybe that one's the real Pinkie. Please, the real Pinkie Pie never sat that long in one place her whole life. I'm gonna go ask. Of course she's gonna say she's the real Pinkie. They all do. You're wasting your time. So let me guess. You're the real Pinkie Pie. Heck if I know. Could be any one of us if you ask me. And if I said I was the real Pinkie, you wouldn't even believe me anyway. So just leave me alone. I've got some important poke in the ground with my hoof to do. Oh, Spike, how are we gonna do this? I can't risk sending the real Pinky back into the pond. I miss the real Pinky. <sighs> I bet she misses you too. Bet she'd do just about anything to get to be with her friends again. Hey! Hey! What if you gave them a test? Pick something really hard for a Pinky to do. Something not fun at all. 
Any pinky that can do it goes back into the pond. But whoever wants to stay the most, that must be the real pinky. You know, that's not a bad idea. This is great! If I pass, I get to be with my friends again! <gasps> but what if I don't pass? Oh, what if I'm not the real Pinkie Pie? Oh! Stupid magic mirror water! This is all your fault! And mine. Hey, Twilight! I've been looking all over for you, ponies. What are you all doing here? Fluttershy spoke with the Woodland Critters, and they've agreed to take us into their home till the Pinky Storm dies down. You guys, we're gonna fix this, and I know exactly how. Are we gonna lose our real Pinkie Pie? I don't think so. Now come along. I've already got Applejack and her family rounding up all the Pinkies. Yeah, the Pinkies! Yeah! They wanna play cheese! Rest. Welcome, Pinkies, welcome. Please have a seat and make yourselves comfortable. Okay, I suppose you can't be comfortable staying in one place, but have a seat anyway. Sit down! Better. Now, I suppose you're all wondering why I've gathered you all here today. For fun? No, just the opposite, actually. Wait up! I got one more! Found this one poking at the ground with her hoof, drawing brownie faces. Have her come sit with the others. Pinkies, you've been brought here to take a test. Aww. Don't worry, it's a simple test. About as simple as they come. And whoever passes gets to stay. <laughs> Curtain, please. The test, we'll be watching paint dry. <laughs> On your mark, get set, go! Whoa, this is so exciting! Okay, maybe not that exciting. Oh, hey, look at the birdie! <laughs> away now. I passed? You passed. You're the only Pinky who kept staring at the wall. I had to. I just had to. I couldn't leave my friends. I just couldn't. But I guess sometimes I will have to choose between them. Knew you'd be up to the challenge. I'm me. I'm me. I'm me. Or am I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I am. Dear Princess Celestia, it's great to have fun, but it's even greater to have great friends. And having lots of friends means that you sometimes have to make choices as to whom you'll spend your time with. But that's okay, because good friends will always give you lots of opportunities to have fun. So even if you're missing out, it's never for long. Respectfully yours, Pinkie Pie. Hi, Pinkie Pie. We were thinking we should go out and celebrate. You up for some wheelbarrow races? Or I could take every pony on a cloud ride. I could 
throw a party with punch and zesty cucumber sandwiches. <laughs> you want to know exactly what I feel like doing right now? <sighs> That looks like fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <baby. laughs>